Most R users will have to work with spreadsheets at some point in their careers. This chapter will teach you how to import data from a CSV or an XLSX file and how to get the imported data into a format that's easy to work with. Additionally, this chapter will demonstrate how to import multiple files at once and combine them all into a single data frame. So starting with CSV files, R has a function called read.csv, which allows you to read a CSV file directly into a data frame. So let's start with a code snippet and say I had a CSV called example CSV at this file location. We could store that, that full file path into a variable called input and then use the read.csv function and pass in the file location and, and then store the resulting data frame in a variable named df. Uh, it's worth noting that it isn't necessary to store the file path as a variable before calling the function, but it might be a good habit to start that could save you time down the road. Alternatively, if you had multiple files from the same directory that you need to be imported, you could do something like this. So instead of having the full file path, we just uh, store the directory in a variable, and then we create a variable called first file that's pasting the directory in the file name, and then we can create a separate variable that still uses that directory, but then pastes the second file name. So that way we're saving ourselves a little bit of retyping code, but then ultimately we're doing the same thing. We're reading that first file into a data frame called first DF and the second file into a data frame called second DF. So Excel files are handled really similarly to CSV files with the exception that you're going to need a separate library called read Excel. So we will attach that library to our system with the library function. We'll specify the file name and file location, and then we'll pass that into the read Excel function. And that will give us a data frame that we can save as the variable DF. You may also come across a situation where you have multiple CSV files in a folder that need to be combined into a single data frame. The read CSV function from the reader package accepts paths to multiple files and will automatically concatenate them along the rows as long as the columns all match. So what we would do is first install the reader package and then attach it to our system. And then we would specify the working direct directory that contains all of our CSVs. So we store the text value in a variable called WD, and then we use the directory function, give it the file path, and then we say that the pattern is CSV files. Then all we need to do is read them all into a single data frame with one command. So you'll notice we put, instead of running this directory command separately up here, we just put it directly into the read CSV function. 